We're getting ready for the chill. It's been raining um, quite a bit. Everything's holding up quite well. Um, I just had a chance today to do some work and um, I did something on the chicken coop run that's going to help uh, winterize that as well. So um, it was something I didn't think I'd be able to, to get done, but I did and I'm happy I did. And chickens are certainly happy that I did too, so I'll show you that. First off, I went ahead and painted this grill uh, all black. It was pretty beat and needed something, so gave it a little bit of a facelift. So pretty happy with that. Also, we got these nice kindling holders. Um, very easy. Uh, the cinder blocks with two by fours very simple but very effective and, and uh, we we're able to clean the yard up and uh, and it looks pretty sharp if you ask me they're really nice looking so coming on over here here are the babies hey girls are you happy with your uh, your coop all right so check it out I went ahead and put two by fours across here um, on both sides uh, to give it some more strength. And then I put, I had to cut um, one of the roof uh, pieces that I had gotten, but it wasn't long enough, so I, I only had a little bit left. And I, so I had to improvise and put two sheets together here and it worked well um, so far so good I even used a little bit of that mastic stuff that was left over from the other roof but I had as you can see I did have to put these two together with these um, with these screws and then I put this uh, one by um, for uh, uh, another piece of strength to go across and hold the ends and uh, like I said, we got some rain and it worked great. Uh, it's just the weight of the snow that might be a little concerning, but we'll see when we get there. You know, we are expecting some snow uh, pretty soon here, uh, within two weeks. Uh, so we'll see uh, what happens there. I'll certainly keep you guys, um, you know, up to date on, on how everything's going with all of the construction that we put in together here and uh, the preparation for the winter. These girls are slowing down considerably on their production. Um, we've been putting uh, some apple cider vinegar in their water um, and uh, one of them, uh, the Bard Rock over here, uh, Marianne, she uh, she had a soft egg two soft eggs so uh, we've uh, since implemented some oyster shells in their food uh, as uh, apparently uh, she's lacking in calcium so I guess that's a good boost for them so we'll see what happens with that we haven't all the other ones are doing fine with their eggs and none of them are soft um, the, the one that's doing extremely well is the youngest, and that's the uh, Wyandotte in the back over here. She's um, she pretty much is having an egg every day still, uh, but uh, close second is uh, is our Americana that's uh, you know, maybe one every two days. But, uh, that's perfectly fine with us. We're we don't go too crazy with the eggs, and. Uh, we can um we'll just keep uh giving them their nice little shelter here and and keep them happy but the strength now it was just so janky before on this run um i've also done some other stuff over here so back here is the start of the extended run that i'm building here so i've got these uh these posts in the ground here and I'm going to use I've already got this panel up here which is fine um, I have this 
this panel here just sitting here it hasn't been working yeah I haven't got it down yet and I don't think I'm gonna use it I don't know yet um, but I possibly can use it from here to here uh, so I might just do that and then use or cut a piece off of this roll here for the longer part but uh, this will give them plenty more room to uh, stretch their feet out and I think they're going to be extremely happy with this larger run. Everything was so brown for a while, but now I just decided to give some, put some water on this area to get the grass production going. And um, you know, we just like a little greener area in this immediate little area that we hang out in. And um, and so far, it's coming up really nicely and really pleased with this um, you know just to so we don't have some dirt to always look at it just looks really nasty and uh, you know I've also got this area right here um, in front of the driveway that I'm doing here too so it's a nice little area to green off and uh, hang out in over here so so there's a little update on our chicken run uh, improvements for winter and uh, again we'll update you on how things go with this improvement we put on here uh, uh, as far as all the other stuff uh, everything's doing great with the water repelling off from the rain I mean it was it was coming down for a while it wouldn't stop for a while there so we're happy with that. So I'll talk to you guys on the next one and I uh, hope all is well.